Hello everybody, it is Luna and you're seeing me in some hyper casual clothes because I'm actually, I was actually just about to go for a practice swim at my local gym and I just put like my leave-in conditioner in. I don't have any makeup or anything because I'm trying to give my face a break. Um, however, my mermaid cream soda package that I got finally came in and there had been like some issues with the post office so i bought this like a month and a half ago from uh, a seller on lace market because i missed the initial launch um i also just didn't have the money at the time and this tape is louder than i anticipated <laughs> and i'm super excited because hopefully i will get to twin with some of my com members which will be so much fun. Okay, let's see here. Okay. Uh, okay. So it came with the bag, which is awesome. Angelic, pretty. It looks like it was originally they got theirs from Paris. Okay, and then the head goes with it too. Oh yay! That's how the matching with boo. That doesn't, <laughs> doesn't match what I'm wearing. But, oh my goodness. The head bow has like little stars on it. I think like how, to me I'm like that makes me think of starfish in this context. There's little stars on it and I love the custom lace that Angelic Pretty does. And then the fabric is like slightly, it's got kind of these, like I'm gonna get really close to the camera. I, wanna, I don't know if this will pick up. But there's like these little like clearly intentionally like almost frayed bits creating like a sparkle effect. I have never seen that in or outside of Lolita. It gives a very cool effect because you can actually see the sparkle from a pretty good distance in person. I don't know if you can see the sparkle from a good distance here. Also, I'm holding like the smallest item. Okay, there's the head bow. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay, I saw that the straps were tie straps and I actually, my waist is pretty low on my body. So I'm wondering if I can drop like the straps down. That's something I'm super excited to see, but I also don't want to mess it up. Okay. So, oh my goodness, we got more of those stars here. There's little starfish and shells. I have more lace here. Um, a waist bow. It smells amazing. <laughs> I could smell it. <laughs> I don't normally smell all the dresses I get but it smells amazing whatever this person like used for the fabric softener before they got it before they got it to me and then of course the thing i was the most excited about is the mermaids in the cream soda i gotta find them where's mermaid cream soda I love the cream sodas. They're so cute. Angelic Pretty Cafe. I would drink all of these drinks. I don't know why, but I thought for like the longest time there was like mermaids in the cream soda. That doesn't look to be the case. I think I may have imagined that. <laughs> but it's still amazing. I love this so much. It's got such a cute aquatic theme. It matches like my Mersonas colors perfectly. I'm currently like perfectly matches my Mersonas colors. Oh my goodness. And then there's so many like ties and shirring, which is awesome because it will means that's very adjustable in size because I've actually not seen this before. Um, so the shirring panel back here has two sets of waist ties. Um, not even two sets, but like, so you can kind of more form fit it, which I think is great. We'll see how that works in practice because I've never seen it before um, when I put this on. 
after I get back from my swim, so the lighting may change. Okay, and then, let me see, is this untieable and retieable? Yes, it is. The straps are fully adjustable. This is such a clever design. I'm never gonna be able to tie those bows quite right again, but I just had to now. I, <laughs> uh, I just had to know. Okay, let's see here. Try to tie these really nicely. But yeah, so one thing I did not know before purchasing this is it looks like Angelic Pretty put a lot of thought into making this adjustable. It has a nice showing panel here. I've certainly seen bigger showing panels, but it's Angelic Pretty. That's kind of to be expected that it's just a little bit of stretch. Although some of their dresses have a lot of stretch. This one has just a little bit, but I think this one has bigger measurements to start than some of their other dresses do. Oh, actually, there's the two bodice ties and then there are waist ties. So there's three different ties in the back, which from the front, I can imagine that'll make it really really like nice to look at it might be a struggle trying to make sure that all three of those look nice from the back oh my goodness yeah so there's still like that sparkle fabric detail going on all over this dress um which is super cool i love i love purchasing lolita dresses from bigger brands because when you get it there's always like surprises all over it. Um, I like these ice cubes, these little star dots. Um, and it looks like, like the ice cubes are like falling into the drinks, obviously. There's like whipped cream on top. And then there's all this whipped cream and it is just adorable. And I had totally missed the seashell hem lace. The hem lace is seashells. Guys, the hem lace is seashells. Oh my goodness. So I am definitely going to be throwing together like a test cord when I get back from swimming. Uh, this is so cool. Oh, I'm so happy that I have this. Um, I've been in Lolita fashion for a total of five years now, although I feel like I really started to get my footing about three years ago, well, I, 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 it took me a long time <laughs> to learn in Lolita, so it took me a bit, and also just to be in a position where I could buy something like this, um, like right off for such of a newer release. So I'm really proud of myself. I'm really excited to try this on. I've been imagining cohorting this since it came out. I already have things that will work wonderfully <laughs> for my cord, um, but it is fall. <laughs> so I'm not really sure what meets I have coming up that will really facilitate this. But yeah, and I'm so excited to see how much I can customize this dress using the ties to make it really fit and flatter my body, or if that'll backfire. So we're gonna test the fit and I'll also share what my dress size currently is so that if you're thinking of buying a dress, buying this dress, you, know, you can have it as a reference when I get back. So wish me a happy swim um, and I will be back soon. For you, I'll be back in like the next second. Hello, I am back from several swims. It's actually been about a week and a half since I actually received this dress where the first clips in this video were because I kept trying to fit into this dress one way or another, but I just do not, unfortunately. Um, and I was really excited with the plethora of waist ties that maybe, hopefully, this dress was maybe set up for people who are a bit bigger. It's not the end of the world. And I put together this cord that I've actually been planning for because I got several things from Rare Magicon that I wanted to wear with this cord. And I wanted to share with you the cord that I would have worn had I had fit into this dress right away. Um, my plan is with it, since I am spoiled with waist ties, is to actually use the waist ties to create 
um, more panels, pretty much the very common way people will often um, alter these dresses. However, I want to see if I can avoid cutting into the fabric as much as possible so that I could put it back together the way that it came if I ever needed to or wanted to in the future, which will be a bit of a design challenge, but I think I can make that work without actually cutting anything up. I'll just have some very creative seams going, I think. So here is the dress. Um, just for the basic thing, I did get it with the head bow. So I'll run you guys through it real quick here, and then I'm gonna bring the camera over to show you guys the details of what I have chosen here. All right, so we can see here some of the details. So you see the little star lace that I was talking about. You can see kind of like this like sparkly material that they included. And to echo that in the cord, I wanted to put these sparkly mermaid earrings on. Um, and then I have this pearl necklace, which is just like a simple pearl necklace. We have these adjustable shoulder straps, which I am in love with and think look very cute. Uh, we have more star lace here. And here's the little sparkly ice cream thingy that mirrors all these floats down here. And we have the cute little seashell lace at the bottom. Here's what the back of the dress looks like. So you can see the adjustable straps from the back as well. There are these three ties, which I was super excited about and made me hope this would fit maybe a larger size. But again, I was overly optimistic and I should have read the measurements and been more realistic, but that's okay. I really wanted this print either way, quite frankly. So I'm, I'm willing to do the, the homemade tailoring. Also, that might just be a good skill to have, considering how much I love Lolita and wanting to get more prints like this. I absolutely love the, the soda here, and it says mermaid soda. It's super cute. And I have, I can't believe how good that accessory that I already have goes with this dress. I just noticed some of the ice cubes are star-shaped is amazing and there are these little things that say angelic pretty cafe and just these like little bubbles and dots and there's so many colors here um i'm not a huge fan of yellow but the yellow looks great in this print honestly um i don't own a lot of yellow accessories but that could be fun for somebody who really likes yellow i know for a lot of the people who have honey cake they might have a lot of accessories that might go pretty well with this due to the yellow in the print and then yeah i just want to take another look at this i love this this accessory it goes so well with this dress so yeah it's turned into a bit of a project but i i totally think that it's doable and that i can get that done and i also like how well this because this is a non-removable waist tie i really like how good that this not waist tie but bow. I like how good that that looks. But yeah. All right, so thank you guys so much for watching. That is my um, review and unboxing slash review of Mermaid Cream Soda. I really wish I could have worn it, but it just straight up doesn't fit me right now. Um, also, just for reference, I wear a size 14, 16 currently so if you are of a similar body shape and size just as a heads up this is probably not going to fit um i've been wanting to try to like share that as a bit of a guide because sometimes measurements for me i can get away with something that's not technically up to my measurement due to the particular composition of like my body and how it will react to being put in clothes sometimes so i like to share that with people in case they're thinking about trying to push that measurement in their dress or not. Um, it's usually advisable not to, but uh, we all do it from time to time. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you've made it this far and you liked the video, please consider subscribing, commenting, telling me what you liked or didn't like about the video. Um, I really appreciate it. Any engagement is super helpful. And I hope you all take good care of yourselves. Make sure you drink some water, eat good food, get enough rest. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Luna, out.